And the governor of Bayonsa State, Doye Diri, has commended the security agencies for their selfless sacrifices in maintaining peace and stability in the country. The governor came out with uh, this while speaking as a special guest of honor at the 2021 end-of-year get-together organized by the Joint Task Force South-South, Operation Delta Safe in Yenagua. Our correspondent, Jesse Essay, was there. <laughs> Governor Doye Diri was represented by Deputy Governor Lawrence Rujakbo. According to him, despite daunting challenges, Nigeria is far better than most countries in the world in terms of security. This, he said, was due to the commitment and sacrifices made by the security agencies. He applauded Operation Delta SIF for their relentless efforts to make Bayesa State peaceful, but called on them to do more. I will be very, very unfair to myself and to the Nigerian country, and especially the Bayasa State government, if I do not want to commend or fail to commend the men and officers of our men in uniform over the sacrifices they are making for our country and our state in particular. More often than not, we try to compare ourselves with people who are higher than us. We always fail to and forget to compare ourselves with those who are below us. Our country, people say, is not stable. There are countries that are worse than our country. And so it is because these men have made sacrifice at even the detriment of their families. The issues plaguing the Niger Delta are still very much right that have not been plucked down. And so the Operation Delta safe relevance is still not doubted. Its needed cannot be negotiated, and its pursuit cannot be interrupted. And so we want to encourage you we still have some pockets of dissidents, disgruntled, and uh, unscrupulous civilians who think they can become general when indeed they've not even gone to the military school. The commander Operation Delta SIF, Rear Admiral Aminu Hassan, said the event was held to give thanks to God for many successful operations in the year 2021. The event was conceived to mark the end of the 2021 calendar of activities and give thanks to the Almighty God for the various successful operational activities and achievements made within the outgoing year. It is also an opportunity for members of the Joint Task Force and their families to interact with members of the larger society in a relaxed atmosphere after the year's stressful activities. High point of the event was the presentation of special plaques and souvenirs to Governor Doye Diri and Deputy Governor Lawrence Rujakbo for their commitment to good governance and security of the state. Jesse Yese for Plus TV Africa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.